normally advise sort of as a basic, try and avoid washing your jeans for the first six months. This is where you'll see, when you do come to wash them, you'll see the most changes then, rather than just sort of, if you tend to be, if you wash them maybe a little bit too early, you'll just sort of rinse the jean out and you, you won't get the wear-ins that you want to see, the honeycombing and the whiskers around the front. Actually, there's loads of different fangled ways. Um, some people will just hang them up outside overnight. If you've got like a nice clear night, air them out a little bit. Um, another way that we found a lot of people using is to just pop them in a plastic bag and leave them in the freezer overnight. This, I mean, there's, there's a few different opinions on this. Some people think that it'll, it completely sort of eradicates the bacteria, when really it kind of just freshens them up just that little bit and gives you that extra little bit of lease of life. On the backs of the jeans you can see here, like down the leg, where you start to see the honeycombing appear. And then you'll also notice quite a big difference in colour as well. So obviously as, as, as it goes on, as with everything, t-shirts, everything, put them for a wash a couple of times, you start to lose a bit of the colour, they fade in. As you're wearing more, they sort of de develop a bit more character and you've, you've sort of come up with something that's your own, like every, every individual wearing around the pocket is something that you've had in the pocket. The main one now that you see on everybody's old pair of jeans is the big rectangle iPhone shape front pocket. And also on the back, you know, the bigger your wallet, you'll start to sit a nice square appearing on the back there. And you know, that's, it's those sort of characteristics that people like to get into.